So then, we are back with more understandings from the time of the Second Tabernacle Services, where we find then the Aramaic English translation of the word. This translation comes from the original manuscripts of the prophets of the Itzayelic lineage. So then we can understand the time of the end, as per then Yerushiah the prophet. We find then a scripture regarding then the 61st chapter, where then the Messiah himself spent some time during his duty, performing then the completion of the spring feast and then the autumn feast. These understandings, however, they are for the set apart, those people who were then from the Itzayelic lineage. We Gentiles, we wait outside until then we watch the Creator taking care of His own people. So then, as per Yerushiah, the prophet, we find in a time of restoration and reduction, then we find also Gala or Revelation 1 8 explaining then regarding his people, the Creator's people, to come out of the system and then resume the Second Tabernacle services. This is what the Creator expects from his people. So then, since the Creator expects this from his people, then obviously. Regarding the nations and the system coming, and then regarding the specific Chinese system yet, then we must make sure our nation then is updated with this taxation system. Because when the time comes, when the system is available, there is no turning back. If the system is not prepared, then it gets jammed. And then the system halts, gets stuck, and there is no way of furthering. Let me explain why. Two years ago, IMF already explained that our monetary system, the U.S. monetary system, would not hold for very long. They gave the estimate of five years maximum. So then, two years is gone. We have then 36 months to complete the five years stipulated by IMF. So then, truly indicates when the time comes and then our country is not taxing instantly when the system becomes available, there is no way of turning back. The government won't be able to get in a system because it is an overseas system. The president can log in the system, the vice president can log in the system, they can do trade with the system, but they can't play with the system. Neither can they adopt the system because we don't have enough products to start up our own. And quite frankly, the creator would not let because he already made his decision. The time of restoration. When was the first relationship with the Creator and the first human being? Comes the Ishmaelites. Where do you find oil? Most of the oil you find from the sons of Ishmael. Do you have any idea the uh, linking of trade and oil? You can have the best system in the planet if you don't have crude, you don't have oil, you have no delivery. There are other countries yet you could get crude or oil from, but quantities are very limited yet. So then let's try to understand what's the function of Arabia or then the sons of Ishmael. They already understand that they have a very important role in the future, very near future. It's not only making deals with nations and have their oil then sold. It's understanding their function. So far they have no function. 
they do what the other countries do. You know, they have oil, it's for sale, they make a deal. But then the future, it is given them the leadership amongst the nations. Gentile wise level speaking, not tabernacling. They have a function. The Ishmaelites are going to be doing the diplomatic work amongst the nations. So then when the time comes, then the system is downloaded, then the government is halted. There is no way of going any further because then the government can maintain a track. So at the moment our monetary system goes down, the government is extinct. How are they going to pay the workers? How are they going to pay the police, the military? They can't simply generate number in the computer and then how are they going to function? How is it going to work with a bank? It's not only throwing themselves in borrows over there in the Ozarks and expecting to give orders from the holes. There won't be a financial system on the surface. How are they going to get taxes from the system? They won't. This country does not take seriously when the IMF speaks. But then we've got only 36 months to make up for it. We've got to get our taxation system exactly the next 36 months. Because the Chinese system is not going to be available only in the U.S. It's going to be around the world. We won't be able to compete. So then, if our government does not get the job done in the next 36 months, UPS is going to take charge of the country. Try to understand the scripture, Revelation, where do you read in Gala? And the merchants of the earth. It's not speaking of government. It speaks of transport. Do you understand the power is going to be with the transport? Not governments. That's maybe why we don't find then the leadership of the time of the end in Daniel. Though he explained it. Daniel said some sort of a wording while he was writing that did not make any sense. But those had meaning. The merchants of the earth. Did, does it say governments of the earth? No, the merchants. The world's power rests with merchants. Transport. The governments are not relevant because the system is self-regulating. You don't have to have politicians anymore. Let's try to be smart. 
and understand the scripture because truly it is implicit. When you read Galah 1 8, what do you understand? It is then a time period from after 2009 until prior of the starting of the vengeance. That's where you'll find Gala 1 8. Merchants of the earth speaks of freighters. Those are in charge. Governments are no longer important. Though the kings, to understand the kings later, they're going to cause trouble. That's much later. The first understanding of merchants speaks of freighters. Because governments around the world are going to be found faulty. So the problem is not complicated. If you evaluate for what it is, grab a piece of paper and write down every financial institution in our country. Each of those including banks and any closed circuitry of transfer of fund those must be registered has to have a social security number and a legal name and a total under a social security number then is related obviously with the financial institution in whatsoever capacity. If you find the same social security number in 10 of those financial institutions, you have to come up with a total. If the government stipulates 10% is theirs, they are not interested in 90. Those are yours. They want their 10. They unrelentingly are searching for their 10. You can have 90, it's more than fair. So it's not truly complicated. But it's a lot of, what's the word, you know, the slang, elbow grease. You have to find the places, they have to stipulate then a percentage of taxes, what level of taxes, what kind of income related with. Then when after this is done, in terms of taxation, instant taxation, then comes what system is going to bring. Then it is simply measurement of the totals every time. If it goes below, then that's okay. Because the last transaction indicated not above the level, but below the level. If you make a purchase, you have to pay taxes. If you make a transfer then of the future system into your banking, then you have to pay taxes, even though you not, did not make a purchase. Because comes from unknown sources. This new system must be considered is an unknown source. Because the government does not know what you are investing, because it is confidential. But it is an unknown source, so you have to tax it. Then goes to another level. If you make a purchase, you have to pay taxes. If you transfer more money, to your banking, then you have to pay taxes. Because it's a form of earning. Unknown source.
if you transfer 10 cents, a cent is of the government. Then if you make a purchase, you have to pay taxes. It's instant. Then, wheresoever then the system goes and flows through our country, it is always monitored. Let's say then later they want to buy more systems in our country. Those would be tracked. So then the Chinese system does not take over the government. But as far as we understand, we are already taken over by the Chinese system. And the idea of the government going to a hole over there in the Ozarks won't work. The freighters won't let them. They had to maintain the roads. Has to have a system on the top. And you can't be sure of it. The freighters are not going to be, you know, resting during time of work. They're going to make sure they're going to secure proper amount of fuel, crude. So the government does not have any choice. They have to work in this taxation system and get it done the next 36 months. great country of Australia, they are already doing it. In a limited understanding, they are trusting people are going to file their taxes. And they are upgrading their broad band circuitry. And then the Australian Post is already involved in the midst of it. Upgrading for more parcels. Stay away from those paper types of mailing and then obviously increasing the number of parcels. So let's evaluate what would be the best for them. If we would have the example from UPS stores, let's say USPS no longer has a store or then the stores are then deactivated. They only ship and receive. But then they let the civilians or then the regular people to do the storing for them. As UPS do with these people. So then you generate more jobs, yet you are participant of the system. But then unfortunately USPS, they have their stores, but they don't make the best use out of them. When was the last time you found USPS representatives at your store trying to make a deal because they have the lowest prices of the market? Wouldn't it be natural for you to receive then a visit from a representative of USPS and trying to make a deal with you? They don't care. But when they transfer these storing power to those people interested in make a trade out of it because that's going to be the future. Transportation, parcels, boxes. then USPS can come out of the hole. So then, the Australian government is already working on the broadband. It is a perfect time then to work with their taxation system. Instant taxation. This is a story all you have to then to file your taxes before this date 
Forget it. Because when the system comes, they won't be able to prove. It's international. It's an unknown source. They can only detect when there is banking linked with it. And you can only monitor the volume of money going in and going out. How are they going to file taxes? It's confidential. It's related with the foreign system. It's virtual. Okay, you have over there then a closed financial system. Then you have a certain amount of money over there. When the system comes, the Chinese system comes, then you invest in their products. You find nice pliers, for instance, high quality. You think 50,000 plus units are going to be sold in the next 10 days. Or by the closing cycle, when they, you know, calculate the numbers. You invest and you receive. It's confidential. Going through then a circuit that is closed. The government can't get in there. You're going to deal directly with China. How are you going to prove an unknown source if the source doesn't show? You file what you have from your own country. However, you have a thousand times more than the system. They can stick their noses in there. And then making civilians responsible for then the postal deal with it. You know, the postal dealings. You have a store over there, a person that brings the item in and mention, you know, ship this. And gives you a piece of paper and pays for it. You're responsible for boxing and making sure then the item is properly sent. Thus you have your trade. Sending packages. Then the postal truck comes around, brings the boxes to the main depot, and goes out. It's quite disturbing in America, for instance, we have USPS with the lowest, the lowest price in the adult market. It's incredible. We have nearly a federal agency that go into a hole with the lowest price in the market. How can you have a trade that is a hundred percent a hundred percent a win? A person wins a hundred percent because you have the lowest price. And they are not marketing. And then they have their own junkie stores barely making for themselves, giving out boxes without charging. It's crazy. Doesn't make any sense. If we were talking a double, charging double, then it's understandable. But it's the lowest price. And it's not marketed. For instance, these USPS stores, no longer the stores. Give those to those people outside, linking up with the system, making them the store. You have 36 months to get the work done. 